All right, hola amigos y amigas, Ephesians 6 today. Um, for anyone who's in the middle of a spiritual battle, or a battle of any kind that might not be spiritual on the surface, but is spiritual at its core, um, which I think we all need to be aware of that, right? We need to hear it. So, um, Ephesians 6, 10 through 12, Finally, my brethren, be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. Put on the whole armor of God, that ye may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. So, um, it's always, it's natural to kind of go to war with the person, uh, or to fight on a surface, worldly level, um, and uh, we need to uh, resist that temptation. Ephesios 6, versículos 10 a 12. Por lo demás, hermanos míos, fortaleceos, fortaleceos en el Señor y en el poder de su fortaleza. Vestios de toda la armadura de Dios para que podáis podáis estar firmes contra las asechanzas, asechanzas del diablo. I'm just trying to get through the words. <laughs> I've kind of hit a wall with my Spanish. I'm kind of in the middle and I don't seem to have progressed much in the last couple of few months. Uh, porque no tenemos lucha contra sangre y carne, sino contra principados, contra pro protestares, contra los gobernadores de las tinieblas de, de este mundo, contra malicias espirituales en, el, en las alturas, alturas. So yeah. Um, spiritual wickedness in high places. Um, if that's you, if you're the one who's kind of being the channel for the dark side, um, I would repent. You're on the losing team. Thanks for watching. Dios te bendiga, hermanos y hermanas. Hasta luego.